I'm Mark Malliard, and I'm uh, originally from Omaha. I uh, spent most of my uh, early life here before going to Northwestern University and graduating from there. Then I came to the University of Nebraska College of Medicine and stayed here at the University of Nebraska for my internal medicine residency. I then went to the University of Florida and stayed there both as a fellow in gastroenterology and as a faculty member for nearly 10 years. I like gastroenterology because of the diversity of the patients. The uh, patients have all sorts of medical problems. We have the digestive diseases, you got the diseases of the pancreas, the problems in the liver, and um, through endoscopy we have all sorts of ways to help people including um, different d uh, treatments for all these medical problems. We can get a lot of people better and I think that more advancement has occurred in gastroenterology than any other internal medicine subspecialty in the last 25-30 years. Some of the most common things we see would be like heartburn, uh, ulcer problems in the stomach, irritable bowel syndrome, something as, as common as constipation and diarrhea. My specialty, however, is focused on problems in the liver and uh, we are particularly interested in uh, treating patients and curing patients who have hepatitis C infection. So the bulk of the patients that I see every week have hepatitis C and have come from three or four states sometimes to see me. I went in academics because I think that uh, in terms of taking care of patients, there's tremendous ab uh, ability to help people who are really sick and who, are, who need more specialized care. Although we take care of all types of people, from very general problems to very specific ones. And at an academic center, you have the ability to really focus in on difficult problems and really um, the state-of-the-art therapy, the ability to have people around you who are also learning, and then the research opportunities make it really a place that uh, patients should consider when thinking about getting their care for their problems. It's really important for me to establish a relationship and to listen to the patient's problems. Um, from there, I think it's also really important to get them to participate in their own getting well. And that takes education. It takes education about the reality of their problem and what we need to do to get them better. I think I'm really lucky to be a physician because the, the most priceless thing is the relationship with the patients.